It's lies, all of it. I don't care what she told you, it's all lies. Feralda, don't act like she didn't say anything. I know her, and I know what she's been up to. My problem with her? She's the one who has a problem with me. She's threatened by me, by my skill as a wizard, by my elegance and posture, by my superior good looks. But she is not going to get the better of me. Oh, no. I won't let it get to me one bit. That's what she's after. She's trying to undermine my confidence, make me doubt myself. Well, it won't work, I tell you. All right, then. I think the college... My problem with her? She's the one who has a problem with me. She's threatened by me, by my skill as a wizard, by my elegance and posture, by my superior good looks. But she is not going to get the better of me. Oh, no. I won't let it get to me one bit. That's what she's after. She's trying to undermine my confidence, make me doubt myself. Well, it won't work, I tell you. All right, then. I believe I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. Welcome to the college. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. 
We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. After I finish showing you the grounds, we can talk. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. After I finish showing you the grounds, we can talk. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. Well, that depends on what you're looking for. Veralda can teach destruction spells and offers training in that school. Finnis is one of the best conjurers in all of Skyrim and can help with spells from that school. Don't let Tolfdir fool you. He's the preeminent scholar on alteration. One of the best in Tamriel, and always willing to pass on his knowledge. If you can find him and focus his attention, there's a great deal Drevis can teach you about illusion magic. And finally, there's Colette. She may be difficult to get along with. She's very knowledgeable when it comes to restoration magic. There are no expectations. This college is a place to study and practice magic freely. Hopefully any discoveries made in your pursuits will be shared with the members of the college first. That way we all benefit. Another new apprentice, I see. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely.
Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire, we seek only to help Skyrim, to guide its people through this time of transition, to help lead them to a better future. I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. Your superior and I were simply having a discussion about my level of access to the college. Well, perhaps that is why you're merely an apprentice here. Nothing you need to concern yourself with. I shall be quite capable of observing everything that goes on here. Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, what you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several, if you're talent. You are new here, are you not? Of course, we have not dear, spoken. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. Sir, <laughs> how quaint. I am Savos Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Are we clear? You have no idea what any of us are capable of. Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power, not something to be shunned by commoners or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on us. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era, Beyond that, it's hard to say. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant loss of our history, I'm afraid. The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the college, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. We also must make an effort to avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of us. The sea of ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. Entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, and so here we remain. You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Is that so? What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Why don't you actually show us something? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to break spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. 
Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the rope. Here we go. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Keep your water, or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. My listener. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. Good to see Scott. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. Your enemies will soon know the wrath of Sithis. It's always in spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. I can certainly share a bit of what I know. Mm -hmm. New here too, eh? It's good to see another Nord. I feared I'd be the only one. Almost doesn't feel like Skyrim, being so far away from the rest of the world here. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting that this is what I meant to do. I know he's from the Thalmor, and that he claims to be here simply as an advisor. I also know that no one really believes that. I've been trying to avoid him, honestly. And I will follow Child. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting. Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. 
throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now are the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Until next time. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Ah, this is good. But Gisargo will know them first. It is good to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Gisargo. Oh yes, Gisargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully, small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. There is much for Gisargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gisargo will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod and the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gisargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Gisargo to become great. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. Mm-hmm. Skyrim could not be more different from elsewhere. Magic. Magic is the same no matter where you go. It's no secret that the college's reputation in Skyrim is... tainted. I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not... Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. If there are any problems, let me know. It's my job to keep things running smoothly. Let me give you a bit of advice. You want to work on something that's not officially allowed? Don't tell anyone you're doing it. You need something you're not officially supposed to have? You come see me. You tell anyone that I told you, and I'll fry you from the inside out. I think the college is due for a change in leadership. Don't trust that one. He's up to something. Most here are up to something, of course, but in his case, it's not good. I haven't figured it out yet, but I will. He is rather handsome, though, isn't he? Until next time. And vengeance festers in the sun. If you're working on any experiments, please clean up after yourself.
This is exciting. And here it? we all are. Shall we step inside? All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. I you find know, it hard to believe be this excavation was here. approved. As some of you may know, Sarthal was one of the earliest Nord settlements in Skyrim. It was also the largest. Sacked by the elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthal. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such an early civilization and the magic they use. Well, are there any questions before we begin? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students, that would be a happy coincidence. Do now. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> This is better than sitting around talking about magic, don't you think? Before you even ask, yes, I have an ancestry steeped in magic, and no, I don't want to talk about it. Yes, I know Winterhold used to be full of my kind, and no, I don't care that they're all gone now. Does that cover everything? Of the Dark Brotherhood. All I've just been asked this. enough questions. I'm here to learn not to explain myself over and over. Forgive me. I didn't mean to assume. Why? Because it's old and full of dead things? Clearly, you've never spent any time in Morrowind. Not really. Just that it's very, very old. It was one of the first cities of men in Tamriel, I think. I know I don't like the way he looks at me. I can't tell if he expects me to blow myself up or to try and murder him. But he clearly doesn't trust any of us. All right, then. I live... again. I find it hard to believe this excavation was approved. Hopefully, we can learn something from the experience. How the ancient Nords Restless used magic. Maybe even what happened to this place. No. There's no chance anyone in authority approved this. Our ancestors should be allowed to rest in peace. I'd better get going. anything he asked far far too many questions about my research I think the Thalmor are trying to steal my work I haven't told him anything of course what I'm doing is far too important can't breathe a word of it what pray all right then We 
should find a random stranger to murder. Practice does make perfect. My blade. What in the world is was that yours. racket? Is everything all right? How in the world did that happen? Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? I can I'm afraid I didn't it. see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to their ruins. And no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look Again. inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? Mm -hmm. One day, you will serve our dread father. His heart. Never should have come <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
vapor in the air. I can taste it. My 
blade is yours. Imagined we'd find something like this. Why is this buried so far within Sarthol? There is murder in here. I can taste it. This is it. simply fascinating. I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, Suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sidgics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Powers of the Void. All right, then. What do you I need, Thane? I'm my still brain. here. Let's get going.
What could this place be? My listener. I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Savos Aran of this discovery? Please, hurry. I live again. This is simply fascinating. Let him know that we've unearthed something, well, I'm not sure. Something unique, let's say. It's clearly magical in nature, but like nothing I've ever seen before. You should be most interested. Lead on, sister. Oh, I think I'll be fine. We seem to have eliminated the most pressing threat. It certainly seems that whoever placed this here intended for it to be well guarded. I wonder why. Take care now. I grow restless, as does my blade. Are you quite sure we need to be speaking? You know, they say knowledge is its own reward. What you learn here will last it's no secret that the college is... Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. Have you heard the tale of... Very well. I trust that you wouldn't be here were it not significant. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Tolfdia normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Now if you'll excuse me. What do you need, Thane? There is murder in the air. I can taste The Jarl it. has recognized you as a person of great importance in the hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way to tell them who you are. The wrath of Sidis. Do you need something from me, Thane? Or can I carry something for you?
Let's go. You are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? If you're feeling adventurous, I'm always looking for someone to procure valuable books from some more dangerous locations. Well, all right, here. I scribbled down the last place I'd heard My about. Check it out, but be yours. careful. I know what you want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not anymore, anyway. I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. I live... again. He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. Although now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. Let's just call it a difference of opinion with the college. They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows, so they were persuaded to leave. As a matter of fact, there are. Have you ever heard of Shalador? Immensely powerful mage, back in the first era. Had an understanding of magic few have ever matched. He holed himself up in Labyrinthian and devoted all his time to research and study. Wrote more than you would imagine possible. Since then, his writings have been scattered all over Skyrim, but are little use to anyone who can't translate them. I'm one of the few who can. I've heard whispers of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful to all of us. A mage is only as good as what he knows. I try to make sure as much knowledge is available as possible. We've been keeping this collection since the second era. Books have come and gone during that time, but it's mostly intact. Of course I do. If I didn't, most of these books would have been burned to ashes or dissolved to nothing before the third era. Mages need to be reminded to be careful around research materials. Assorted books, scrolls. I'm sure you'll find something useful. We are mm -hmm. now, you and I. Joined through the powers of the void. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Are we clear? You there. I have questions for you. 
I you were in Sarthol, yes? Yeah? It has come to my hand. attention that something was but found there. have been made listener. I know full well that you have. Please do not insult my intelligence. Tolfdir is still there now, is he? I shall expect a full report when he returns. It is my job to know these things. My role as advisor to the Archmage is aided by knowing everything that transpires here. My listener. Thank you for your help. You may go now. I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not a matter. shouldn't have been disturbed. Yes, but it needs to be kept quiet. I may have entered into an agreement with Enther. He had something I needed, so I traded him something of mine. It was a mistake, and now I want back what I gave him. It's an amulet that belonged to my family, and I never should have given it to Enther. But he won't deal with me. Talk to him. See what it'll take to get my amulet back. Until next time... Can you... can you possibly help Jazargo? Until next time. Huh? If you have a moment, could you help me with something? The exact nature of my research is a... You mean the official sort of business? Hmm. Well, no. No, not really. Until next time. At least something good came out of that trip to Sarthal. I didn't... We're all trying to become better mages, right? Well, I need someone I can practice a few spells on. Nothing dangerous, really. Would you be willing to assist me? Well, I... I simply I thought you might wish to help out one of your fellow mages. If that's not enough, I suppose, I have this amulet you could take. Oh, good. I was afraid I'd have to go ask Jazargo. Now, you just stand there. Please hold still, and don't move. There! Now I... Oh, dear. That wasn't supposed to happen. Do you... Do you feel all right? You look very... Um... Green. I am so very sorry. I went over this again and again, and I was sure it would have better results. I'm not really sure. I think it's just a minor miscalculation on my part. I'm sure it will wear off soon. When it does, you'll be perfectly fine, and then we can try again. In the meantime, I'll see about figuring out what went wrong. Until next time. It is difficult to admit. Jazargo has seen that Torfdir likes you. 
You must be very skilled with magic, yes? Cesargo is working hard, but cannot do it alone. Can Your you help with this? Will soon know the Cesargo has worked hard on learning new spells, trying new things. This will make Cesargo stand out as a mage. But Cesargo works so hard, there is no time to test these new spells. If you help with the testing, this will make learning easier. Cesargo will give you scrolls. You will use them and report the results. This is a good plan, no? You tell Cesargo when you are ready. <laughs> you can resist, can you? Let's see. This one, I think. Cesargo has designed it to be an excellent flame cloak with a twist. It is especially potent against the undead and should burn them to a crisp in no time. Cesargo gives you plenty of these scrolls, so you try them and return when you can say whether they work. Cesargo awaits word of how well his scrolls work. Have been disturbing Sarthal, no matter what you found and out. I joined through the powers of the void. I'd better get going. Even with the college's laid back attitude, there are still some things. There are some experiments the well, I hope we have got some coins. Us. Uh, let's just take a look then. Onmund is too afraid to deal with Perhaps me himself, and so he sent you to murder. I'll make this very simple for you. All my trades are final. Onmund knew this ahead of time and went through with it anyway. So there's nothing more to be said. No, no, you're not understanding this. Onmund made a deal. He made that choice, and now he has to live with it. I've already made it very clear that all of my trades are final. Oh, I suppose, but there is you keep this to yourself. I don't want it being known that I go back on my trades, understand? Till next time. We shouldn't have been dis- <laughs> I didn't think he'd really give it back. Thank you, friend. It's good to know I can count on you. Thy grows, as does my blade. Until next time.
I think the college is due for a change in leadership. All right, then. The Imperials are good for business, and business is good for Skyrim. Smell around you. Wait. I know you. Wait. I know you. decided to open a store, buy and sell whatever is needed. Yes, love? Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. I'll be here, my dear.
You stand right there and count to ten. No peeking. Seat of the Ready? King Go. Of Skyrim. Messy business, King Slaying. Uh, but so very satisfying. <laughs> will soon know the wrath of Sithis. I am your sword and your shield. to see you again, my thing. And vengeance festers you. the other day. He was really scared. You got me a present. I was a young rascal. I broke a man's arm with a single punch. Of course, I had a horseshoe hidden in my glove. I thought adventurers were supposed to look tough. I bet my papa could beat you up. Sure, whatever you say. Bye. Papa says I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Oh, well, you'd think so, wouldn't you? I'm fine, thank you for asking. It's never been an issue. People say you helped with the problems at Wolf Skull Cave. I applaud anyone who assists the court. As does my blade. Clothes and raiment for the discerning customer. Finally.
the dread father works through me, and his work has just begun. Hey, hands off! Come quietly or taste of y'all's justice. Close enough. The what do you think you're doing? Way. Stop. You have it's committed crimes sure. against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Perhaps we should find a random stranger. All right. To but you just watch yourself. Next time I might not be so lenient. Unless we have specific business, I'm not interested. When I was a young rascal, I broke a man's arm with a single punch. Of course, I had a horseshoe hidden in my blood. Hello, I'm Gizli, but you can j Welcome to the center of the world, or at least my brother Eriker's world. Long since I killed a stormcloak. Sword arms getting flabby. What are your thoughts on all this? Something to report? My the general and I have our disagreements, but he's the best hope for both the Empire and Skyrim. You're going to Riften. My spies report the Jarl Steward Anuriel has arrangements with the Thieves' Guild that would be rather embarrassing if made public. 
I need you to find evidence of her corrupt activities and use it to gain a measure of her cooperation. This will require stealth and discretion. The Jarl's guards won't take kindly to anyone rummaging through her steward's private quarters. I can't taste it. Good. I can always count on you, can't I? Stay sharp. Keep an eye out for Stormcloak spies. Tribune? Take a look. Tribune. What do you need? Huh? 